pony white ass. Or take my picture with your new camera. <laughs> what? <laughs> I can't dance for shit. I'm like a I'm like a freaking like Tina Turner type of thing. From Bob Bob's wait. What is Tina's last name? Anyways, from Bob's Burgers. I literally can't dance for shit. That is literally my dance. I just kind of just wobble. I just wobble. Don't expect me to dance. Just... Maybe maybe a couple shots and and I'll I'll dance like I have a like a spider on me. But other than that, I can't dance for shit. At least she the looks happy rolls. and Can't not sad anymore. Rock out, girl. Yes, break it down, Max. <laughs> this is adorable. Yo, turn it off. Turn it off. How many times have I told you to stop blasting that punk shit? Dude, the music's not even on. Asshole. I'm coming up. We need to talk. Oh, no fucking way. You need to hide now. My stepdad will kill me if he finds you here. Chloe, what's going on? Open this door, please. Chill, I'm changing. Is that okay? Max, Crap, where do I hide? To hide now. Chloe, I'm coming. What are you doing? I guess Chloe, the closet. I'm changing. Give me a minute. Don't get so oh, crap. Let... Chloe, you're stalling. I'm changing. Give me a minute. Don't get smart. Just let me in. Okay, now. in, in, in. Please. One second. My bra is stuck. I'm amazing. I'm screwing around, Hell soldier. yeah. Shit. What's going on in here? Jesus, I'm just trying on clothes. You're so friggin' paranoid. Yeah, combat will do that to you. Oh, you know, he's, he's rather uptight. One of my guns is missing. That wasn't me. Did you take it? Oh, God, I didn't take your stupid gun. You do know I believe in gun control? Wait, is that grass? You been token up again in here? Oh, yeah, guns, weed. You were tripping balls. I'm sick of your disrespect. Tell me the truth. That's an order. Whose is it? Shit, do I stay hit? Mm. I'll stay hidden, because I think it might make it Stop worse if I come out. Stop treating me and my mom like we're your family platoon. Hey, leave Joyce out of this. I wish you'd leave Joyce, like now. Ooh. Chloe, I'm sorry. Oh. I care about your mother and you just keep pushing me. Don't touch me again, asshole. That was a no-no. No. time. Or I'll bring the cops in here so fast. You're not that dumb. I'd be smart to have you busted. Chloe. Someday you'll grow up. Ooh, that is a massive red flag if that's his first response. Hey, you okay? When he gets mad, it's just a Welcome swing. Welcome the real step douches of Arcadia Bay. I'm sorry. He might need to For talk what? to a therapist. He'd be a bigger dick if he caught you in here. That's hard to believe. Anyway, let's sneak out the window. There is one cool place we can go to in this hickhole. David was such a mean bastard to Chloe. What if I had stepped up to help? Would it have been better if I stepped in? I don't know. We can try it. I feel like it's a bad idea. Okay, what happens if we step in? I'm sorry. That was my joint. Well, well. I don't like strangers in my home, especially dopers. Oh. So you're bringing drugs into my home. How about if I call the police? That'd screw up your spotless Blackwell record. You do seem to get around, Max. I'm Excuse sick of you losers you? dragging Chloe down. Missy, you sure do like to pop up and start trouble. Like this afternoon. You don't have anything smart to say now, do get you? Get the hell away from huh? her, man. Stop harassing my friends. You don't have any friends. Like you know, you're not even a real cop. Wow. You're a fucking security guard. I was a soldier, Chloe. You're a dick. And Max, if I see you here again, you'll learn all about real trouble. Because you're such a badass, Max, 
Let me show you my new toy. I don't know if that was good or bad. Damn. I mean, I'm glad that we stopped her from getting hit. But... I'm Price. Chloe Price. Oh, Bang. oh Jesus, god damn it. Thing down. Why did you Relax, take the gun? Sister, it's not even loaded. Yet. I thought you believed in gun control. Yes, I believe I should control the gun. It's the men who need to be checked. You trust Nathan or David? Thanks for taking the heat. We totally smacked his punk ass down, Max. He's no yeah. match for you and me now. I feel so that was an epic win. So mixed right now with my feelings. Anyway, let's sneak out the window. There is one cool place we can hang in this hickle. I'm so I'm so conflicted with my feelings Man, right now. It did not go well for me. If I want to keep my Blackwell scholarship, I shouldn't lie for anybody, even Chloe. I have to think about my own future. Do I shit? I don't know if I should just allow her. Mm, no, you know what? No, no, we're gonna stick with this timeline. I want to know what happens. I just there's no there's no right or wrong answer here in the end because we don't know what's gonna happen. I'm very conflicted right now in how I feel about this because one, clearly the guy has problems. He needs to see a therapist. Um, it sounds like he's. I don't know how long it's been since he's um, it's uh since he came out of the military. But sometimes transitioning out can be rough for some people. And it, I think he needs to talk to someone, especially because he's got some anger problems. And based off what we just saw, if his first reaction, like when he was talking to her and she was like kind of getting shitty to him, was to smack her, that's concerning. That is concerning. Which kind of breaks the question, if she continues pushing his buttons, what else can he do? But then the other thing is, he did straight up ask her and she's lying to him. And being in that situation where, like, in a sense, she's gaslighting. She's sitting there. He's saying, like, where's my, uh, have you seen my gun? Where's my gun? Is this, is this weed? And, sh uh, and she's sitting there telling him that he's crazy. He doesn't know what he's talking about, that he's going nuts. Like, it kind of goes to show that she's also intentionally triggering him like they're both in the wrong here and i, I just I, oh i'm so conflicted in how i feel i think this is just a, just very toxic and icky and i just don't like it like he needs help she needs help they need to talk to somebody maybe 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 family counseling i think she's taking out her frustration on him because he's in her eyes he's not her dad I think him being kind of a hard ass the way he is doesn't help the situation. And it's just fueling them both to like constantly fight each other instead of like working through. I'm just going to keep moving forward because I feel like I don't want to, I kind of want to see what happens with this playthrough. I think they both need some help. Well, there's the lighthouse again, but there's no tornado, so... When does the tornado come into play? Or was that really just all a dream? I don't know. <gasps> oh! Hi! We found Bambi. Isn't and this awesome sauce? Now I want some deer jerky. When we were kids. Come on, slowpoke! Hold on! Deer jerky sounds so good right now. I, I do love me some forever. venison. So why do I feel like I was just here? Whoa. This is the exact same path I was on during my nightmare today. Huh. Okay, so we saw that. There's some random trash there. Oh shit, Warren! I forgot that he took a beating for us from um Nathan or Crap, what's his name? Hold on. Yeah, Nathan. You're my white knight, Warren. Um here. I know you were worried about me. Aw. Oh, you're I can't read for crap. Your white knight Warren is here. Damn, he got a nice black eye. 
Massive props, though. Like, he, he jumped in to save the day. I owe you. Thanks for today. I'll call you back, okay? I swear. No problem. You still have to tell me your big secret. I don't know if we should tell him. Let's see. There's something from Victoria. By the way, thanks. But we're not friends. You know what? I'm gonna make a friend out of you. Or maybe, like, a... A frenemy? Where we're just acquaintances, but we still hate each other, but we tolerate each other. We're gonna make it. We're gonna make this work. Thanks again, uh, Max, for helping me. No problem. That guy's an asshole. I'm so glad that we actually did help her. I I feel so sad that Kate is completely bullied and no one's standing up for her. Like it's so shitty. Birds are so lucky; they can always escape. Oh, what happened? Oh, interesting. Looks like the youth of Arcadia Bay still come up here to party. Ooh. I never made it. Trust no one. How long has That's that a fair been point. Here? Oh my god, I forgot all about this. Too bad I can't rewind that far back. Is that supposed to be- Oh, it's supposed to be Max just like with some cursive. Oh, that's kind of cute. Sure you don't want to be alone? I really like the skull work. My pleasure. Feels nice out here after all that drama. You really took one for Team Chloe. <laughs> I'm not as brave as you. And David is indeed a step douche. I'm sorry you had to experience it firsthand. You have to live with him. Has he always been this way? Ever since my desperate mom dragged his ass to our home, I never trusted David. I mean, maybe he makes her happy? It sounds like the feud is between you and him. Again, still need to maybe get some fucking therapy, but maybe he's actually good with your mom and then you guys just need some counseling. He freaked out on poor Kate Marsh today. I know her. She's cool. Only that prick would bully her. He has some kind of weird agenda. He has a lot of secret files. Rambo still thinks he's gathering enemy intelligence. Did you take a peek? On who? Who is he, like, sketchy at, uh, like, like, who is he questioning? You know, I wanted to, but I realized I have enough mystery in my life. I'd like to find out. I bet he's got some serious porn in there. Ugh. Ew. Good thing he didn't No, walk. why would he's you want to know what your fetish. stepdad watches? Cams in the house. Sometimes oh, that's just place. gross. No wonder I'm so miserable. Everybody in this town knows everybody's secrets. What's Nathan's? What's Nathan's secret? He's an elite asshole who sells bad shit cut with laxative. Oh. And he dosed me with some drug in his room. What? I met him in some shithole bar oh, that didn't no. me. He was too rich for the place and too wasted and he kept flashing bills. Just tell me what happened, Chloe. Now. That's that so fucked up. I thought he was so blazed it would be an easy score. You needed money that bad? Actually, yes. I owe big time. And I thought I'd have enough for me and Rachel if she showed up. Oh. So you tried to rip him off and then he dr Oh, that's so fucked up. Oh, no. So, what about you and Nathan? We went to his room at Blackwell. We drank, and I laughed at his rich kid bullshit. Did he spike her drink? He was one step ahead and put something yep. in Yep. God, Chloe. Oh, God. I can't believe this. I mean, I do. Oh. Then what? I know I passed out on the floor. I woke up and that perv was smiling, crawling towards me with a camera. Go on. Everything was a blur. Oh no. I tried to kick him in the balls and broke a lamp. Nathan freaked, so I managed to bum rush the door and get the hell out. <sighs> Max, it was insane. I'm so sorry, Chloe. Oh God, you don't deserve that. No one deserves that. Fuck anybody who who thinks it's okay to like spike drinks. This is what you always, always need to be careful when you are out in public. It happens a lot to women, but I'm pretty sure it happened. I'm, I wouldn't be surprised if it happens to men too. It's just not always reported. But like the amount of disgusting people out there that think it's okay to spike someone's drink. God, this is why this is why they always teach you how to you know to be careful when out in public. Never, you know, if you're going to leave your drink unattended, just get a new drink. Do not trust that shit. Oh my god, I'm so sorry, Chloe. You know what? You know what? 
problem solved. Uh, well, no, because to be honest, it's never going to be solved. Like, this is something that's going to be with you for a while. But, but, we're here. We are your friends. We're going to go cut off his legs. And then we will bury him in a hole. You know what? We'll bury him in a hole, pour some concrete. Problem solved. Problem solved. We, we might go to jail for that. But, oh, you will 100% go to jail. You know what? We feed him to the pigs. We feed him to some pigs. Problem solved. For that situation. And then we're, we're here anytime you need us for whenever you're ready to talk. Like, that is fucked up, man. I vote pigs. I vote we cut your leg. We cut, we cut Nathan's legs off and feed him to the pigs. Apparently pigs eat everything. I'm so angry I'm so for her. Furious. That's I not okay. Speak. What did you do then? I figured I would make him pay me to keep quiet. So we met in the bathroom. And he brought a gun. That was Nathan's last mistake. Oh, wow. I want to say let's call the police, but like... <sighs> I have a feeling this is also going to be kind of similar to what happens in reality, where when you have someone rich like that, especially since his family are, is the founders of this, they're all the, like the police are just going to over overlook it and be like, no, you're the one that's crazy. It, it's really sad how when people speak up about being attacked, they're just so they're just dismissed. I still think you should speak up. You shouldn't stay quiet at all. This is such a Oh, this is such a uh, topic, man. Because like she's the victim, and and she should have her or, like her voice heard. But like you can't force someone to speak up if they're not ready. Mm, I feel I feel weird telling her what we should do. What are you going to do? Pop a cap in his ass? Let's call the police. Screw that. You already told the principal, and I'm sure it's useless. I won't always be there to save you. You were here today, Max. You saved me. I'm still tripping on that. Seeing you after all these years feels like... I'm just happy destiny. that I could do something. God, I'm just... It's just so icky thinking about the Nathan person, man. It gives me the, the the vibes of what was it that swimmer in like Virginia? If this is destiny. I hope we in can find that whole find situation. Oh, I miss her, Max. The shit pit has taken away everyone I've ever loved. I'd like to drop a bomb on Arcadia Bay and turn it to fucking glass. I told you! I knew it! I knew it! Oh no! Oh wait, never mind. I, I thought I thought this was like showing that Why like her powers are starting to affect her. Why like her body can't handle it. The ghost of Bambi. Okay. Maybe it's not. Is Maybe. Still up there? I'm just so confused what's happening. Oh, 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 sweet pearl. Woo! Oh, that that gives me. Okay. Okay. Oh. Okay. We're gonna have to. Fudge! Okay, okay, we're in. I'm trying not to die from a tree. Alright, we're just following Bambi. I feel now very bad for wanting to eat you. I've never seen a storm like this in the I appreciate that you're guiding us. That is a... Did the storm get worse? No, no, it, it looks the same. It looks the same. This area looks worse, though. Oh my lord! The tornado is back! Oh, sweet pearl! Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good. What is that? October 11th? 
Is this Friday? That's only four days away. So, are we seeing a premonition? Oh, no. The tornado is headed straight for the town. That's not good. Chloe, you're here. I'm back. Oh my lord, this is real, it's real. Oh man, this sucks. Max, what's going on? You totally blacked out. I didn't black out. I had another vision. The town is going to get wiped out by a tornado. Oregon gets about five tornadoes every 20 years. You just zoned. No, no, I saw it. I could actually feel the electricity in the air. Come on, take a breath, okay? Chloe, I'm not crazy. But there's something else I have to tell you. Something hardcore. Talk to me, Max. I had the same vision earlier in class. When I came out of it, Look at their friendship. I discovered I could reverse time. Like I said, not crazy. But hi, right? Listen to me. How do you think I saved you in the bathroom? By reversing time? Yeah, sure. I saw you get shot, Chloe. Saw you actually die. I was able to go back and hit the fire alarm. Okay, I see you're a geek now with a great imagination, but this isn't anime tell or Tell her video. to tell you something you and then rewind time. Powers, Max. I don't know what I have, but I have it. And I'm scared shitless. You need to get high. It's been a hell insane fucking day. <gasps> what the hell is this? Snowflakes? It's like 80 degrees. I'm so confused. Oh, climate change. Or a storm is coming. Wait, what? Max, start from the beginning. Can that happen? Tell me everything. Wait, wait, if it's 80 degrees and a tornado is coming, can it really trigger snow or is it just the game and I'm going crazy? Well, there's her mother. So we have four days. Four days to save everybody. No pressure. No pressure at all. Four days. We can do this. We, can, we got fucking superpowers. We are the next Spider-Man. Who the fuck are you? That's a puppy. That's a good pupper. I don't like you. Screw you. Being all about the money. I still don't know how I feel about you. You just give me the heebie-jeebies. Like the ick. I just got the ick when I see you. Especially because of the, like, students' light. Like, uh, it's just, I don't know. It's just icky. Who are all the names? Was that somebody that we should know? Sweet! We got through episode one. Hell yeah. She still has that creepy damn wall. Am I the only one that finds that creepy? Like, I get it, I get it, you take photos of people, like, you take photos of anything and everything. But you have a f whole wall of photos of people. I just find it creepy. After staying up all night, I could use my rewind to catch a few more Z's, but maybe I better save my strength. I also feel like that's kind of abusing your ability, especially if you have any side effects. I feel like you should probably get up. Yeah, chicken shirt. A superhero is dirty work. Do we have I'm a roommate? Sure. I mean, it, clearly it looks like no, but it looked like some rooms had possible roommates. 
I feel like with dorms, though, usually everybody, t like, they tend to pair you up with at least one roommate to be able to bring in more people. I am so not a rebel. I always like my bed to be neat and tidy. That's definitely not me. Uh, I forget to actually photo memorial do my bed all the time. Look. I woke up. I'm not. I'm not awake enough to even remember to to actually make my bed. I am not a neat and tidy person. I get up, throw my clothes on, and go. All right, time to go to work. That's pretty much me. All right. Do I need my books? I could rewind for days and read all of these books. I wonder if she's even thought about attempting to see what her limit is no, with her powers. Take your power seriously. is that i can't say you know what no no i can't say anything because in all honesty this my selfies are horrific crazy historic moment in my life the amount of times i take a photo just to find the right photo my husband can take one photo and i'll be like nope nope take take 15 more because honestly i don't like any of these drink up it's got electrolytes can you overwater this plant I am going to try to not be like how I was when I was playing Mass Effect and accidentally killed so many fishes because I kept forgetting to feed my fish. I'm going to make sure I feed my plant. Watch me come back and my plant's dead because I overwatered still it. Out sick. All right, pea plant. somebody say she has severe depression. Poor thing. Okay, Max, let's hit the show. I've always been curious when I was growing up what it would be like to live in a dorm. Or a boarding school. Because it always sounded fun, but I wonder if it actually was. If anybody's actually lit, like, went to a boarding school, did you actually enjoy it? Or did you prefer, like, a public school? Oh, wait, we should go check on... That is so mean! Stop writing nasty stuff on her thing! Why are you guys so rude? Oh, we can't write anything good? Kate is an early bird. She might be up and gone. We'll try one more time. Always knock three times. Kate is an early bird. She might be up and gone. Oh, never mind. You okay, Alyssa? Immature assholes. Sorry, Max. I'm not feeling social right now. What happened to you? <laughs> Full on party going on. All right. Wait, is this the person who apparently might have gotten pregnant? That we didn't see the, the pregnancy stick? What's happening, Dana? Everything cool between Everybody's you and Juliet? Oh, yeah. Thanks again for releasing me from her captivity. By the way, or was that the somebody best else? and biggest news of the day is that Trevor asked me to the Halloween shindig. That's awesome, Dana. At least we're showing our faces together in public. So you absolutely should go with us. Borrow one of my outfits I don't and remember. come as a cute geek couple with your bitch Warren. Uh, I have a flea brain. Big on cosplay. Don't let life pass you by, Max. So, are you coming to the party or not? Why not? I mean, it might actually be good if we need to. Why the fuck not? If I hate it, I can always go back to my room. That's the spirit, Max. After this, and we'll maybe we can make some acquaintances. It does sound like fun. We might. We now I have to go contemplate my party future. We kind of pissed Nathan off because we did tell the principal that Nathan had a gun, and of course the principal turned a blind eye. Due to the fact that his family, like, pays for everything. So maybe if we make more friends, we can have them on our side. That is so damn cute how much Dana is into this Halloween party. I mean, who doesn't like a good Halloween party? Hello, Juliet. Hey, Max. Did you check out... Honestly, she should drop him. Video yet? Why should I? Because it's fucking hilarious. Church girl gone wild. Kate's not like That's that. That's horrible. Not. Really? Check her out and tell me what she's like. Do you believe everything you see? Like Zachary sexting Dana? Touche. Now I feel like an ass. Thanks for finding out the truth yesterday. Oh no, it was her boyfriend. I forgot about that. Not her, not, not the others. Also, why are they... They're so... They're such dicks to poor Kate. Like, constantly spreading rumors and treating her badly. Is this is that what it's like in boarding schools? Are they very clicky? I guess I could see it for grown freaking adults being clicky. You would think it would be kids, man, that would be clicky. But it's like freaking grown ass adults. 
30 and over that are the like the most clicky people ever. What did you do about Victoria pulling that crap? Nothing yet. My mind works in devious ways too. Glad to see you're back in action. You have a good heart, Max. And I won't watch Kate's video anymore. Or pass it on. That's the spirit. Thanks, Juliet. Sure. Talk to you later. I'm kind of glad we stopped that. I mean, I really do hope we actually stopped that. Hey, bro. But oh, hi, Matt. if we could stop them spreading like bullshit lies about Kate, that would make me happy. Did you see the freak snowfall yesterday? I was riveted by that weird snow flurry yesterday. I can't tell if you're being serious or not. Um, since I'm a science noob, I was wondering if you could explain it. I'm serious. Even meteorologists can't explain that snow. I bet Warren can. Did you talk to him yet? Oh, crap. We haven't spoken to him since he sent us the picture of his black eye. I will later. Lucky you. I'm sure he'll track you down, Max. I'll see you around. Does she have a thing for him? I mean, why doesn't she just... No. You know what? I feel like even if she did, he's been kind of... I think when we met up with him in the in the parking lot, it seems like he might actually have a thing for Max. Okay, where, where, where's the bathroom? <gasps> we found Kate! Let's see if we can make her, let's, let's see if we can see if she's okay. Hey, Kate. How are you doing? I'm here. Thanks again for standing up for me yesterday. I needed that. Anytime. That guy has issues. Doesn't everybody here? By the way, Max, do you still have my copy of the October Country? Oh, yes, of course. It's great so far. I, didn't I have no clue what that what that book is. Poet. Can you please bring it back to my room this morning? I just need to take some notes for class. Absolutely. I'll bring it by later. Wait, wait. Is everything okay? After my shower, I'll bring her book back and that'll be a good excuse for us to chat. Maybe just talking with a friend will help her feel better. To be honest, I think just her having a friend. Because it sounds like everybody's isolating her. And we've seen what happens like when you isolate people out and bully them. I just I just kind of don't want anything bad to happen to her, you know? I think especially after COVID and like a lot of the stuff. What's oh up, no. Kate? Oh no. Cool. That's it. That video of you clubbing didn't look like homework. Victoria, that wasn't me. Oh my god, right. Don't be shy. I think it's awesome you set a tongue record on video. That's <laughs> going fucked to up! Oh, boo-hoo. I'm sorry you're a viral slut. I'm sure she had fun. Looks like it. I know Nathan hooked her up. And you know he has the good shit. Preach it, sister. Yup, I still have goddamn paint all over my face. Good thing my faithful minions took their sweet time bringing me a towel. We ran all the way- Give it a rest, Taylor. Now I know if I'm in an accident, I won't rely on you or Courtney for help. You can hang out with Kate. Or Max. Wow, so I was kind of She's nice to you and you're still a us. dick. I hate that I'm so quirky crap. Anyway, let's leave the link to Kate's video so everybody gets a chance to see her in action. You are such an evil BI. Why? I love it. <laughs> okay. Is there a way we could, like, rewind and, and intervene? Besides getting rid of... That? I get dressed, then go give back Kate's book. No, there's nothing there for me to... Okay, we're getting rid of this. That, that's gonna go. Even if I can stop one person from watching it, it's worth it. Face. We look like a potato. He's an adorable potato. Boil him, mash him, 
put them in a stew. Damn it, I want to watch some Lord of the Rings now. I still have so many questions every time I watch Lord of the Rings. Oh, no fucking way. This is not why I came to Blackwell. And I still have to clean all this crap up after I find Kate's book. How did she find out that it was me? How did she find out that it was me? Man, this could almost be art if it wasn't so fucking sick and disturbed. Rather disturbing. I kind of like it, but I'm also into like, not, not in a sense of like they're bullying her, but I also like like creepier stuff. I mean, I love horror. I look, I love horror movies and like creepy shit. Okay. But at the same time, that's got, that's kind of disturbing. Oh shit. Nathan oh, Even I thought it was Victoria. The principal. Never mind. Apparently it was Nathan. For some reason I was like, how did the fuck did Victoria realize it was us? I don't care. He can, he can start shit. Oh. Of course she just spilled soda on Kate's book. Damn it. Okay, okay, let's rewind time. Fast. Kate needs the book and I don't want to add to her list of problems. All right, let's grab. Let's move our thingy. Foul soft drink. Damn it, we should have done that and snooped through uh Chloe's stepdad's uh paperwork. Your mom. I'm kind of curious what what uh he has on people. Maybe it would have told us, like, why people are being rude to, like, well, like, dicks to each other. How do you know how much to water a plant? I, d I don't have a green thumb. Well, my plant's gonna die. Even with all this I accept shit this. going on, it is so... I need to get dressed before oh. I go there. Maybe I'll just put on a shirt and jeans. Hey, Einstein had the same... Do you feel like if our plant dies, that's bad? That would be, like, bad mojo? Them. Like, like, just, just bad all together? And that might be, like... The I idea only take this back to Kate before I'm late. I that everything is I ending. Don't worry about being late anymore. Like what if we don't water our plant and then Chloe dies late. again? Kate? You in there? Yes, I'm here. Hi. I'm in that. Okay, let's see if we can maybe Kate cheer her up a little bit. Dealing with this video bullshit. Kate, your father and I just received a rather her. disturbing call from Principal Wells about you and some party video. Our concerns about sending you to Blackwell seems justified. Please call us after your classes this evening so we could fully discuss this matter. We hope you've brought, uh, you haven't brought shame on you or your family. Wow. Wow. A lot of pressure to be putting on her. That's horrible. We hope you didn't bring shame upon your family or... Or you. Did you ruin your reputation? Kate really has a doting father. And the light shines in the darkness, and the darkness comprehend it not. Katie, you will always be my brightest light against the dark. What? So where is dad? Where is dad to be telling mom to, like, back the fuck off and be nicer to their daughter? I had no idea that Kate ever hung out with Alyssa and Stella. Huh. Why aren't they, then why aren't they defending her? Look at this cute bunny. Can we make a top hat for the bunny? <gasps> we're going to give it a carrot, a top hat, and we're going to make it... Oh, oh, and a monocle. Oh, I'm supposed to be talking to Kate. I'm supposed to be talking... Oh, what's with this? Ouch. She left out damnation. Dear Katie, no spirit or devil could have prepared me for what you have done in that videotape. And like a Jezebel, you released your harlot image before. Is Jezebel mean? Is like is Jezebel like a another word for like a slut? I'm assuming that's not a like they're they're insulting her like they're. Wow! In uh before God's eyes, I will pray for uh with uh my church for your soul. She has a horrible family. Honestly, like look, I'm all for you believing what you want. You you. Like, follow whatever religion floats your boat. But never use your religion. Like, I'm so fucking, like, firm on this belief of, like, never use your religion, no matter what your religion is. If you believe in something or you don't, it doesn't matter. Whatever floats your boat. But don't use it to justify treating others like shit. Good lord. This must be Kate's H.R. Geiger period. I am digging the skulls. I love it. 
I think it looks great. A leaflet. Kate even makes notes in her Bible. My parents never once Aww. took me to church. I had nothing to rebel against. Come to me, all you who are weary and burdened, and I will give you rest. When justice is done, it brings joy to the righteous, but terror to the endeavors. The evildoers. That's so heartbreaking. All right, all right. Oh, what's that photo? Almost forgot what Kate looks like when she's. They had ice cream! I don't know who those were. Uh, hey, Kate, I brought your book. Max, why did you step in between David and me yesterday? Because I'm going to be your friend. That's why. That's why. I hate bullies. David Madsen should know better. I was hoping he would. But it's nice to see that you care about me. Kate, I actually do care. So what's the story with you and David? Well, he's a total paranoid ass. Okay. He thinks I'm part of the Vortex Club. Yeah, right. Should we ask? I feel I'm, I'm nervous about I don't want to ask her about the video. I think that might upset her. So maybe ask just why. Why does he think that? Because he saw the video. You know how humiliating this is for me? I know this sucks, Kate, but tell me about the video and maybe I can help. Basically, I went to one Vortex Club party and ended up making out with a bunch of people. And I'm blaming Nathan! If she has no memory, that mofo has been roofing people. I'm calling it now! I actually don't know if I could even say that on YouTube. Okay, well, he's been putting drugs in people's drinks. And I'm calling it now. Because if you don't have memory of doing something like that, and you did something pretty extreme, it's not unheard of that the, those things kind of happen to people who've had their drinks messed with. And then since we already know that that is something he did to somebody else, I think she's just another victim. Um, okay, what do I say? Uh, maybe, okay, either that's all. I don't want to say that doesn't sound like you. Because that might, that might come across accusatory. Maybe that's awful. Or why would you... I don't want to say why would you... That also sounds accusatory. Let's do that's awful. That's awful. So, how did Maybe that try happen? to just be a, a good sounding a friend. Story. Like, I'm here to listen to I'm you. I'm still trying to sort it all out. You have to tell me more than that. Okay. What happened at the party? Did you drink? I swear to God, I had one sip of red wine. And then I drank water. Hmm. Yeah, that's not... A, that I, I'm telling you. It was Nathan. Not enough to get wasted, is it? I don't get wasted. Ever. I take a sip at church and I don't end up on a viral video, okay? Did somebody drug you? I remember... I remember getting sick and dizzy. Go on. Then Nathan Prescott said he would take me to the hospital. Okay, right there. Right there. Nathan! Problem already solved. Fuck you, Nathan. Part of me is worried about immediately questioning the Nathan Prescott. Did you go? How sick were you? I feel we should we should have questioned did she go because then she could have been tested to find out. Okay, I'm stuck between Nathan Prescott or did you go? Let's do Nathan Prescott. Nathan Prescott? Oh, shit. He was being nice for a change when he offered to help yep, me. Yep, that's how- He's the opposite That's how nice. those freaking creeps are. What next? All I recall is driving for a long time. And I woke up in a room. I thought it was a hospital because it was so white and bright. Wait, what? Go on. I'm listening. Somebody was talking to me in a soft voice. I thought it was a doctor until I heard Nathan and- Felt a sharp sting in my neck. Oh my and god. What the- Why did they- What did they stick you with? And? That's all I remember. I don't know what happened. I woke up outside my dorm room the next day. I didn't have any marks or bruises, but I felt gross. Oh no. So, who took the video of you at the party? Kate. I have no idea. Probably Victoria. She was there being her mean self. Jesus, Kate. I'm sorry. This is serious shit. How do I get a viral video taken down? 
I know it's already spreading. What if my church sees that? I need to know what to do. Kate, we'll figure it out. We're gonna, we're gonna... I'll check back later, okay? We're gonna make friends with some IT folks. Thanks, Matt. And we're gonna find a way to remove that shit. Dad. As best as possible. It's hard because once it's on the internet, pretty much it's forever on the internet. But, but we will find a way. We will find a way for you, Kate. Also, I'm gonna go run over Nathan. I'm just gonna take that truck and just whoop, right over him. You know what? No one's gonna miss him. No one's gonna miss him. It's fine. It's fine. God, I did not expect this game to like go into such dark fucking areas. Oh my God. I thought this was just gonna be like a superpower game. Like, yay, a little bit of problems. Okay, we saved the one person. There might be some drugs. Okay, yay. I did not expect this whatsoever. Nope. Nope, 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 nope. I'm gonna just start making a list of people we're gonna run over with our car. All these horrible people. We're just gonna run them over with the car. You know why? You know what? It's fine. It's fine.